Hey guys, thanks so much for clicking on this video. My name is Chris, bit of a different video today. This past week in Dallas, Texas, where I live, had a little Comic-Con convention called Fan Expo. And well, one of my YouTube friends, Sean Chandler, was holding a panel there about how to be a YouTuber. For some reason, asked my dumb butt to go on there, even though I don't even know how I got here. But I thought it'd be a perfect opportunity to make some content for you guys, even me meeting a couple of fans, showing you how dumb I am with my money and buying some expensive collectibles and trying to get Zachary Levi's signature on one of my Funko Pops. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, I'm meeting one of my first fans here at the convention. What's your name, buddy? Hi, I'm Vincent. What videos of mine you like, Vincent? Most of them. Meeting up here with another fan. What's your name? Name is CJ. What, what did you say your favorite part of my videos was? Just your intros. My intros. And all of, they're funny. They're <laughs> funny. You. They are funny as hell. <laughs> all right, now that the seminar is over, we can go do some shopping. Am I allowed to take a picture with any sexy Harley Quinns? No. <laughs> she said yes, guys, I swear. All right, we're about to enter that hallway right there. Bunch of toys and collectibles. Gonna see a lot of awesome people in costume as well. Hoping to meet some spider people. I want to meet all three spider people, get them to quote Tobey Maguire, and just spend as much money as I can on some pops. Let's join me. Yeah. 80 bucks, that's actually really not bad. That's actually a great price for that. I found the Holy Grail pop line. Let's go in. Look at that. 250. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's fucking talk. 60 bucks. Low key, I have that one at home right now. Space Jam won 80 bucks. I don't know why they didn't make the rest of the Toon Squad. I actually need this one. We got the costumes. I low key want the Iron Giant mask. That is so awesome. How much is that? Wow, wow, it's very nice. How much would the channel hate me if I started wearing a Us cosplay? They got the freaking Halloween Kills mask, that looks so awesome. These metallic Friday the 13th masks are pretty cool. They're cheap, but I don't know what happened to Miguel Myers here. <laughs> what the heck? Is That's what it's supposed to look like. This is what you get. What the heck did they do to my boy Gru? What is this? Oh my god, look at that face of horror. I'm dying. Help me. What did they do to Groot? You can torture him for $29.99. Oh, Green Lantern ring. Oh shoot, that's actually kind of dope. She, if two plus two is four, right? And five plus five is ten, okay. What the fuck is this? Puppet Master, I actually need this one. I bought this one the other day. I love the packaging on this. This is awesome. I might have to get this one. Other than Funko Pops, I love collecting NECA figures. The NECA figures are awesome. $260? Damn, I would have loved that. I guess I'll just settle for the $40 one. Such an underrated reboot. Now this is a sight to behold. I was just able to encounter the entire Spider-Verse. Hopefully I can still see him. A 
Spartan. Oh my god, as a Spartan. Chocolate! I can't hear you! They're selling chocolate! They're selling chocolate! Yeah! They can make a Godzilla costume, that is so awesome! That guy looks fantastic! Oh, that, that's awesome! <laughs> see that? Right, let's see if we can find anything good here. Oh my god, there's Spider-Man puffs, I need them. I need the Spider-Man puffs, get out of my way, woman. Give me my Spider-Man puffs. Get the fuck out of the way! I can't see! There are cars there, motherfucker! Get out of the way! I got most of these. I know I got Spider Pig already. I have Scarlet Spider. I don't think I have Silk yet. I need Silk. They got Spider Punk. Miles Morales. Damn, I would love this Robin one, but that's just too expensive. 55 bucks. I got a $65 Nightwing. 45 for Static. Oh, this is cool. Cinnabites, we got Pennywise, Gremlin, Jason Voorhees, oh this Sam one's pretty cool, they need to update the Freddy Krueger pop man, it looks so old, that's what the old Texas Chainsaw pop looked like, that's so overpriced though, like 45 bucks, isn't this like 10 bucks on the pop price guide? Yeah, they're, they're, they're going a little crazy here with these. But the real question is, is it bolting? <laughs> oh, true. <laughs> Are they making them anymore? Because a lot of them, they're not. Yeah. Lady got salty. I called her pops overpriced. I'm sorry. Little did Chris know he'd come to regret opening his big mouth. This is cool. How much is this one? This one. This one doesn't have a price. I want this one. No price on it? Ask her. You're the fat boy who called my pops overpriced. What do you think I'm gonna price it for you? 55, that's a, again, a little too pricey. I think I can find that for at least like 30 bucks online. On to the next booth. So we can get them a Venom one. Black Panther. Paul cans. Oh, okay, the Spider Man one. There we go, these two. <laughs> he looks so big. The things I would do to him, Ashley. <laughs> that Morty has seen things. Another booth, and we got more pop. Aw, oh, Hobgoblin, look at that freaking price. 200 bucks. Jesus. I don't have him. <laughs> I think we're grabbing Miss Pac-Man, guys. You're coming home with me, lady. I think it's so cute how the men in black ones come with the little guys. I hate these. These are the worst pops Marvel's ever made. I don't, I don't get the whole mechanical robot thing. That's so bad. These Marvel zombie lines are pretty dope though, but I know if I start doing it, they're gonna collect, they're gonna have one out of each character and I just will not be able to have enough space for each one of them. They do look awesome, but I'm not collecting them at the moment. I got everything. I watched this show as a kid, I remember this. Peter's room turned into some sort of like a weird bat cave. Spider-Man animated series. Some $20.99 ripoff that I remember thinking. The Spider Man. The best Spider Man series that has ever lived. Spectacular Spider Man. Now, just like how I like collecting Funko Pops, she likes collecting these little bags. I don't even know. Lounge Fly, I think is what they're called. She loves these things. That Mario one is pretty dope. I like that Mario one. Oh, this Nickelodeon one is cool. It's got all the characters on them. I need you to get this one. You haven't even seen Hercules though, so... I could... Oh my god. Oh, 
Oh, it lights up. That's actually pretty dope. Star. Pull the lever, Crump. This is cool. I like this Camp Crystal Lake one. This is nice. They're coming out with a Chucky one. I'm gonna get you that one. Thank you. No problem. Good to see you, man. I love your intro. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate you. Yeah, my son's gonna freak out. Alright, bye. Nice meeting you. It's an awesome costume, so too. Thank you. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I was like, I know him from somewhere, and then I looked it up, and I was like, is that what he sees? It's always so nice to meet people. That guy was really friendly. And he designs pops. And he designs yeah. pops, so, gotta stay in touch with him. Now, I don't know what this booth is about, but it is definitely funny. What the heck? What's even going on here? The turtles are about to kill Marco and Luigi? I want to see that movie go. Oh, I get it. I get it. It's these bullies, turtles now. <laughs> That's funny. Oh my god, Miss Piggy. Even she's in cosplay. Peach looks like the dragon from Shrek. Oh man. Mario, you know, sort of, this is really creative and fun. I like this. Now this thing, I have seen this on a t-shirt. And it's kind of awesome that this guy recreated it. That is so cool. I think a lot of people have seen this on a t-shirt. How much is this? Oh my lord. I think I would have paid like maybe a hundred, 125 for that. That's, but I'm not valuing the work it probably took him to make this. That's pretty awesome. You can even see Ghostface in there. Kermit and Yoda. That's pretty funny. Imagine that conversation. Would you guys unsubscribe to my channel if I told you I own this pop? It's a bad memory. But it's also a nostalgic one, man. I can't give it up. You want this one? Yeah, it's Glamazon. Cool. 70 bucks, actually. Oh, I think I'm buying this one. This is it. This is the most expensive pop I'm getting. You guys don't know how long I've been looking for this. And that's actually the cheapest I have seen it. Can I get it, Ashley? Yeah. But I couldn't get your zero. <laughs> I'm such an asshole. <laughs> you sure that's the one you want? Or do you want? <laughs> we already have one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you sure? Yeah. We'll look for another one. Okay. We'll get this one, though, right? As our day at the convention was ending, we did have one goal in mind to meet Zachary Levi, the guy who plays Shazam, and get him to sign our Funko Pop. Now, I didn't let my girl get the pop she wanted earlier, so I gave up the sacrifice of giving away my girlfriend to Zachary Levi in order to get that pop signature. The only other problem was I was not allowed to record the interaction only because I paid for a signature, but you know your boy Chris don't follow the rules. Let's go in. Mission accomplished. Look at that to 3C films. We did it, y'all. <laughs> He's so nice. Smelled real good, too.